Hey, what's up, you guys? My name is Swells, and today I'm going to be teaching you guys some top rock fundamentals of how to stay clean and hand gestures. Um, I want to teach you guys today some Indian step, um, and also when you incorporate your Indian step with other top rocks, learning how to transition in and out of certain variations, and then you can also um, add on other uh, steps and using it to your advantage as far as traveling forward and back and side to side. So first step I'm going to teach is the Indian step. Basically you cross your arms like so, doesn't matter right over left or left over right and almost like a salsa step but when you step you're going to step with the right, open up and a lot of people tend to do this when they do an Indian step they step and cross. So remember, it's always the cross of the arms first, and then step with the right. And same thing with the left, cross, step, and then back, step, and cross your arms again, okay? So one more time from the top. So we're gonna cross, step with the right, Back to center, cross your arms again. Again with the left, step with your left, cross your arms back to center, okay? So we're gonna speed it up a little bit. Cross, step, cross, step, cross, step, cross, step, okay? Now that is the Indian step. Um, the next thing we're gonna work on is something a little different but in the form of the Indian step incorporated with uh, movement side to side or front to back okay so we're gonna cross our arms um, and then we're gonna cross step cross step and now this time instead of coming back to center we're going to step back with our right so back, um, we're gonna step back with the right of the left foot. So one more time, cross, step with the right, cross back to center, step with the left, and our hands basically go down and the right goes up, and the right foot steps behind the left. And then we go back to center, Same thing, same movements back to center, crossing the arms, okay? So one more time, right, cross, left, right, come back to center, cross, right step, now the other way, left, same exact thing, but stepping back this time with the left behind the right, and then back to center, same thing, Cross, step, left, step, cross, step with the left, back with the right, back to center, cross. So we go one, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three and four okay so that's the back step um, from an Indian step okay so we're gonna incorporate that together uh, but we're gonna move a little faster this time so we're gonna cross Indian back step center cross Indian back step center cross Indian back step center okay cross Indian back step center cross Indian back step center. Okay? Alright? Alright, cool. So we just went over the Indian step and the back step from the Indian step traveling forward and then back. We can do that however you want. Um, certain variations as far as Traveling forward is Indian step, you know, 
and then going back to spin, a center, spinning, and then actually coming back like that and spinning back the other way. So there's so many different ways that you can play with the Indian step and the back step. Um, just make sure that you are doing that back step, you know, from the Indian or the Indian, and then the back step or the back step, spin, and then go to the Indian, okay? Always cross your arms first before you're doing, doing the Indian step and then coming back with the right or the left on that Indian step for the back step. Once again, this is the Indian uh, plus the back step with front and side to side variations, front and back side to side variations of the Indian step and the back step incorporated with other movements if you want, but this is the basics of a top rock for you beginner b-boys out there or someone that just wants to be more knowledgeable in top rocks. My name is Swells. Thanks for watching. Tune in. Hope you subscribe. Thank you very much. Peace.